Welcome to Redevelopment Works, a program highlighting the Fort Myers Redevelopment Agency's projects and programs that, re that are revitalizing our community. Thank you for joining us as we explore the innovative ideas and passionate people who are transforming communities and the ones that are making a difference in our city. I'm your host, Dr. Melanie Long. I'm the Assistant Director of the Fort Myers Community Redevelopment Agency. Are you looking to become more engaged in your community and make a difference in local issues? Look no further than the Civic Engagement course, the Changemakers Lab, Building Civic Engagement. It's an eight-week program designed to provide the skills and knowledge you need to become an effective advocate for your community. I'm excited to lead this effort. The course covers a wide range of topics from understanding local government and policy to developing effective communication and advocacy skills. It's hands-on activities and case studies. They will provide opportunities to put learning into practice and become an effective advocate in your community. At the CRA, we've heard from many community members that want to make a difference in their community but may not know how or where to start or have the tools or the resources to be effective. The Civic Engagement course is designed to provide a comprehensive and accessible way for anyone to learn about civic engagement and develop the skills and knowledge to make a difference. You might be asking yourself, why does civic engagement matter? Can I really make a difference as one individual? Does civic engagement even matter in today's climate? A civically engaged citizen can make a significant difference in their city and community in several ways. You can influence local policy by being actively involved in local government and policy making processes. A citizen can help shape decisions that impact their community. This could include advocating for changes in zoning laws, supporting initiatives that promote sustainability, or working to improve public transportation. You can increase community involvement. A civically engaged citizen can also inspire others to get involved in their community and work together to address issues and achieve common goals. This could involve organizing events or initiatives that bring people together, or simply modeling the behavior of an engaged and active citizen. You can improve the quality of life for yourself and others. Through advocacy and community involvement, civically engaged citizens can help improve the quality of life for themselves and their neighbors. This could include working to reduce crime, promoting economic development, or advocating for improved public services like parks and libraries. Overall, a civically engaged citizen can play a vital role in building strong, vibrant, and resilient communities. These communities that are able to tackle the challenges of the future by working together and taking on an active role in shaping the future of their city. Citizens can make a real difference in their lives and the lives of those around them. The Changemakers Lab course is open to anyone who wants to become more engaged in their community and make a difference. Participants can expect to develop the skills and knowledge to advocate for issues they care about and become more effective community organizers. The Civic Engagement course provides a comprehensive and accessible way for anyone to learn about civic engagement and develop the skills and knowledge to make a difference by becoming more engaged in your community. You can help shape the future and make your voice heard. You will learn how to bring attention to important issues that may have been overlooked or underestimated and help to bring about a change. You will also learn that you can participate in community-based initiatives such as volunteer work or neighborhood organizations to create positive change at a local level. Find out how your voice can advocate for the needs and concerns of historically marginalized communities and work to ensure that their voices are heard in the decision-making process. You can run for local office. <laughs> I'm sorry. You can run for local office or support candidates who align with your values and vision for your community to affect change on a larger scale. 
Overall, civically engaged citizens have the power to shape the future of their communities and cities and make a positive impact that can be felt for generations to come. Remember, if you intend, attend the entire series, you qualify for reimbursement and you get a certificate of completion. Our first series started on June 1st, but the next one, the next opportunity you have is in September. Classes are limited, so you can sign up for the fall offering today. Space is limited, so do not wait. Visit our website at fortmyerscra.com or email us at fmcra at cityftmyers.com. Empower yourself and make a difference today. Now, let's turn our attention to one of the Fort Myers CRA programs that's making a big impact on our community. It's called the Residential Paint Program, or RPP. RPP is a unique initiative that's helping to beautify and revitalize neighborhoods in the Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. redevelopment area. Through the RPP, qualified homeowners can receive a grant to repaint the exterior of their homes and include and includes the services of skilled professionals to complete the project. The program not only helps to improve the appearance of your home, but also creates a sense of pride and community spirit as neighbors work together to beautify their streets. If you live in a single family or duplex owned owner occupied residence, the residential paint program could provide you with a maximum potential grant of $5,000 per eligible unit. If you're interested in participating in the program or learning more about how it works, visit our website at fortmyerscra.com or email us at fmcra at cityftmyers.com. Beautify your home by contacting us today. We've added an educational component to redevelopment work. In today's educational mini segment, we'll explore the funding mechanism behind CRAs and shed light on how these agencies work to improve communities. Community redevelopment agencies, CRAs, play a crucial role in revitalizing aging, underdeveloped, and underserved areas. However, there's often a misconception about how CRAs are funded. At the heart of a CRA, funding is a concept called increment financing, or IF for short. Increment financing is a public financing tool that allows CRAs to leverage future increment revenue increases to funding redevelopment projects. Increment financing funds are not generated from increased tax rates. Let me say that again. Increment financing funds are not generated from increased tax rates, but from the natural growth and property values resulting from successful redevelopment projects. There's no extra taxing me mechanism. Here's a step-by-step -step br breakdown of how increment financing works. Step one. A community redevelopment agency is established and a specific redevelopment area is designated. Step two, the current property tax base within the redevelopment area is established as the base year value. Step three, as development and redevelopment projects take place and property values rise, the difference between the current property tax revenue and the base year revenue is calculated. This difference is called increment. The increment is then reinvested back into the redevelopment area, funding further improvements and revitalization efforts that are designated in the area. This is all designated through an area plan that is created with the community and with the citizens in that community. Step five, the increment is reinvested in the redevelopment area where it's generated. So if the increment comes from the Martin Luther King Jr. redevelopment area, that's where the money goes. It is important to note increment financing funds do not come from increasing property tax rates. I've said that three times, I'll say it one more time. It's important to note that increment funding funds do not come um, from increasing property tax rates. Rather, they are generated from the natural growth and property values resulting from successful redevelopment projects. 
While increment financing is a primary funding source for CRAs, other funding sources can also be utilized. These may include grants. CRAs can apply for grants from federal, state, and local governments, as well as private foundations to supplement their funding. Also, public-private partnerships. CRAs may collaborate, collaborate <laughs> with private developers and business um, to co-fund redevelopment projects. Community redevelopment agencies are pr primarily funded through increment financing from the city and the county, leveraging the natural growth and property values resulting from successful redevelopment projects. This funding mechanism, along with supplementary sources like grants and public-private partnerships, enable CRAs to make a significant impact in revitalizing communities. By understanding the funding process, you can better appreciate the efforts of CRAs in creating positive changes in our neighborhood. So you've heard all I had to say today. I would ask you to join us in revitalizing our beautiful community through the efforts of the Community Redevelopment Agency. Apply for the residential paint program or share it with your family and friends. Grants are limited, so apply now. Are you ready to be part of the positive change in your community? Remember the Change Makers Lab. Building civic engagement starts again in September. Sign up today. And let's work together to create vibrant, thriving neighborhoods for all to enjoy. Visit our website or follow us on social media to get the latest updates on CRA projects, success stories, and events. T together, we can shape the future of Fort Myers. Act now and make a difference. Thank you for joining us for this episode of Redevelopment Works. Presented by the Fort Myers Community Redevelopment Agency, we hope you are inspired by the stories and programs we highlighted today and that you'll tune in again to learn more about the exciting ways we're transforming and making differences in our city. Thank you. <laughs>